Neom are a homeware and wellbeing brand who create a range of candles, diffusers, bath products, skincare, and much more. They were launching a new bath milk into the market and wanted to showcase this in a fun, dynamic advert for their social channels and website. Our friend Jen has helped bring many Neom campaigns to life and asked us to get involved with the video. So when you mention liquid stores, we immediately think of slow motion using the Phantom. You know, stuff like this. We began putting together a detailed shot list with storyboard references of what we'd like to achieve. We only had one day in the studio, so deciding on the complexity of each shot and the time taken to capture it versus the final output was paramount. We settled on four key setups, including pouring, mixing, details, and product. A large portion of the rigging took place the day before the shoot at our unit in Manchester. This allowed us to maximize the amount of clips captured rather than spending time popping up light stands. After our morning coffee, it was onto the first setup, which consisted of pouring copious amounts of bath milk through a funnel that shot out of the neon bottle spout. We wanted to capture that initial silky smooth pour as though the customer was pouring the milk into their bathtub. Setup two consisted of multiple large fish tanks with lots of resets running back and forth to the sink. We only had one go at a time of pouring the bath milk into the clear fish tank to capture the mesmerizing clouding in the water. We would then switch out the tank and send our production team to pour out, clean and reset the tank for the next frame. After lunch, we moved on to macro details. This is where the syringes, clamps and pipettes come into their own to capture the macro details of that perfect drip. It takes a little bit of trial and error because liquids generally behave differently every single time, no matter how nicely you ask them. But once you capture that perfect splash, it makes everything worthwhile. Finally, we ended on some product details. These included full bottle shots laid flat in plastic trays filled with bath milk. Then it's on to post-production. The 30 second assembly cut came together quite quickly once we transcoded all the phantom footage. And then once the main cut was graded and approved by the client, it was onto the multiple formats. This is something we discussed at briefing stage. We knew certain frames were specifically designed for the 916 version as opposed to the 16x9 edit. We switched out a few shots that fit better in the framing and adjusted the text on screen accordingly. As with all of our projects, we bounced out as many high resolution screen grabs as we could to deliver value to our client. So there you have it. I hope you enjoyed that little insight into our latest project. Thanks for watching.